Hey everybody, I'm back. I haven't made a video in a long time, um, but I, I've made a, a few purchases since the last time I've done a handbag video. But um, one that I'm really excited about, I just got today, I went shopping um, up and down Fifth Avenue and had it in my mind that I wanted a spring bag, ideally hot pink or fuchsia with silver hardware. And there are tons of awesome hot pink bags with gold hardware, especially from Valentino, which I love because I love metal studs. If you've seen my videos before, you know I like black and silver and I like metal studs and grommets and spikes and all that stuff. But um, I had it in my mind that I was gonna get a Louis Vuitton. They have um, a pink Alma BB now, an epi leather with silver hardware. And it's cute, but I don't know, it wasn't the right shade of pink I wanted, more fuchsia. And I don't know, something was lacking. And I've had it in my mind that I was going to get the Totally PM in the Damier et Ben for an everyday bag. But I don't know, something... I passed. So then I was just walking up and down Fifth Avenue and I went into Michael Kors. And when I walked in, it was like, ah, oh, my ideal bag, fuchsia silver hardware and it's got studs and I absolutely love it. I'm so excited to use it and what when best to use it then on the first day of spring since it's a spring bag. So I just got home and I want to put my things in it but I wanted to do this video first so you guys can see a true unboxing well there's no box a, an unbagging I guess of Michael Kors and I absolutely love it. I got it at the Michael Kors flagship store on Fifth Avenue. It always had the best selection there. And I couldn't decide between this one and the crossbody one. But I opted for this one because you can also wear a crossbody, but this one has top handles and it's more practical for everyday use because it's a little bit bigger. So it comes in. This is a nicer, this is a different dust bag than my previous Michael Kors in this dust bag and I'm so excited. I just want to say that I loved this bag way more than any of the high-end designer bags I saw today. I was looking at Balenciaga, Alexander McQueen, Valentino, um, Dior, Chanel, Louis Vuitton and nothing was jumping out at me. So my wallet is very very happy in my bank account and my husband. So without further ado, here it is. So it has all the wrappings on it. But it, let's see, it is the Selma Stud in Fuchsia with silver hardware. Look at you guys, silver, finally. Thank you, Michael Kors. You know, not everyone likes gold. And it's a top handle and you can detach the strap if you want. And this is, you can adjust this and make it long enough for crossbody or make it short for a shoulder bag. And it has the studs on the back, the feet. I just love it because it's fuchsia. And that was the color I wanted, like a hot pink with silver hardware. And I don't know if I like it. I don't like winged bags. I'm not a fan of the Celine Phantom. But I can't do it now because it's stuffed. The sales associate showed me that you can just push the sides in. So I love this. I love these types of bags with the shape, boxy structured with a top handle and a strap. I do want to show you, I, I did make another Michael Kors purchase over the winter because um, all my bags were black and silver up until this point. So when I saw this bag um, over the winter, I had to get it. I'll show you. It's the same style. I don't know the name of it, but it's smaller than this one. And this is a true red with silver hardware. And the silver just pops on the true red. This is a true red crocodile print from Michael Kors. And um, it's not burgundy, it's not orangey red, it is lipstick red. And it, has, it just has a button here so it's open. And it has a detachable strap. So I do wear this crossbody a lot if I'm carrying it and going to work or whatever. But if anyone wants a review on either of these bags, I'll gladly do one. This was my um, new purchase over the winter. 
and this is my new spring bag. So I do have another video coming up at some point where I said I would do, I would compare my Chanel Classic Flap to my Chanel Boy Bag. I still have to do that. But in the meantime, Michael Kors it is. Keep my wallet's happier. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.